right um this is another very important section that is integration using the substitution method uh my aim here is to make sure that uh, you are able to integrate using the method of substitution so that's what i view by the end of the this lesson you must be exactly be able to do that so we are going to progress by a means of uh, examples for example here my on my first question i'm going to give you integration of 3x minus 4 to the power of 4 dx so we want to make use of substitution so which means here yeah, i can even let my let u equals to 3x minus 4 that's why some other people they call it the u method so we how do you progress here we now say uh, in this case we say we we can even differentiate it to say du dx is equal to we differentiate this it means it gives us a 3 so the aim is also to make dx the subject of formula so can you therefore see that um, even my dx will be equal to d goes there it means dx will be equal to du divided by 3 what i have done here i've cross multiplied then i make dx the subject so which means it gives dx is 3 so now i make my substitution which now means it now becomes uh, integration of 3x minus 4 we say 3x minus 4 is u so which means here it becomes u to the power of 4 multiplied by dx this dx we now know dx is now given by du over 3 good so we now have to integrate this going forward it now means 1 over 3 is a constant we can put it outside the integral sign 1 over 3 into the integration of u to the power 4 du integrating this it means it becomes 1 over 3 uh, u to the power 4 plus 1 over 4 plus 1 plus a constant of integration i'll call it c so which now means this becomes 1 over 3 into u to the power 5 divided by 5 plus c uh, exactly which is now equals to u to the power 5 over 15 plus c which is my constant of integration but uh, going going back here we have let u equals to 3x minus 4 so which means where there is u we can even now let it make it to be uh, the original part which is 3x minus 4 everything to the power of 5 divided by 15 plus c which is my constant of integration so let's also proceed with uh, another example uh, in this case for example if i give you uh it's a bit long but it's understandable integration of 3 x squared minus 1 into x cubed minus x plus 2 dx um it's kind of tempting that we remove the brackets and simplify it and go on but uh, that becomes too much 
uh, we can just simplify this by again using the method of um, substitution uh, in this case we are going to let u equals to this bigger bracket here which is x cubed minus x plus 2 now differentiating it it now means du dx is equal to 3x squared minus 1 now going forward and doing our substitution uh, actually we must actually also make dx the subject so can you see we go on by cross multiplying here which means this uh, 3x minus 1 will just go under du which now means making dx the subject it means dx will be equals to du over 3x squared minus 1 now we make our substitution into here so which means this this whole thing is du then this x we substitute it exactly with this one so that's how we are going to proceed so which now means here in this case it becomes integration of the first bracket which is 3 x squared minus 1 into into the second bracket here that you can see we said everything there it's u so which means it becomes multiplied by uh, u uh, then multiplied by dx and our in this case our dx is given by this which is du over 3x squared minus 1 good uh, simplifying it now it means it's now equals to integration of can you see this 3x squared here cancels with this one so which means we'll be left with integration of u du uh, integrating this it now means it becomes u to the power 2 1 plus 1 which is 2 over 2 plus constant of integration which is c but however we had said our u is uh, x cubed minus x plus 2 so which means in this case here it becomes um, x cubed minus x plus 2 everything to the power of 2 divided by 2 plus c which is our constant of integration right now um, another yet another example again um, the more examples we do uh, the better it becomes for us we'll understand this method uh, much better uh, now if I give you integration of 3x into x squared minus 4 minus 4 everything to the power of 4 dx once again which now means it let uh, we again let u be equals to this this is a 4 here let me write it nicely right so which means we again let u be equals to x squared minus 4 now going forward it means i'm going here to say uh du dx is equal to uh, du dx is equal to um we differentiate this it means it's equal to 2x uh which therefore means as i make dx the subject it therefore means dx is equal to uh, in this case it becomes equal to uh, du over 2x again i'm sure you can understand how i made dx the subject here 
so this is very important so in place of dx i'm going to substitute this in place of this i'll put a u so which means uh, it becomes uh, integration of 3x into sorry about that 3x into u I'm sure you can see that to the power of 4 multiply by dx but my dx is given by this which is du over 2x uh, going forward we can see that this x cancels with this x there therefore I'll be left with integration of 3 over 2 this 2 here uh, of u to the power 4 du uh, let's uh, put 3 over 2 outside the bracket which means it's 3 over 2 integration of u to the power 4 du now going forward it now means uh, it's now equal to actually we can now even integrate 3 over 2 into u to the power 4 plus 1 all over 4 plus 1 plus our constant of integration there so which means here it becomes 3 over 2 into u to the power 5 over 5 which is equal to 3 u to the power 5 over 2 times 5 which in this case is 10 therefore it now becomes it's now equals to 3 into remember we said our u is given by this which is x squared minus 4 so wherever there is u we are now put x squared minus 4 so we come here then we put uh, x squared minus 4 everything to the power 5 all over 10 don't forget plus c which is my constant of uh, integration right uh, again uh, the idea is more 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 and more examples let me do exactly that uh, let me give you one more that is to say uh, if i give you integration of 4x all over square root of 2 minus x squared dx right uh going forward uh it now means here can you see there's a square root and it's there you can put it on the numerator which means it becomes integration of 4x into 2 minus x squared everything to the power of minus half dx um that's quite clear then then from there we can now even let uh, u be equal to this part here which means let our u equals to 2 minus x squared which now means here we are saying du dx is equal to differentiating this we get minus 2x right uh, going forward then we do our substitution which means it now becomes our integration of 4x then our 2 minus x squared which is uh, u so it will be u to the power of minus half um just a moment here we must make dx the subject which means here we are saying our dx will be equal to du over minus 2x so which means in place of dx we substitute with this one so which means here it times in place of dx i put du over minus 2x going forward 2 into f minus 2 into 4 
I get minus uh, 2, so which means it will be integration of minus 2. Because this 2 into 4 is minus 2. X cancels with X, then I'll be left with the U to the power of minus half du now going forward it now means i must now go on and say this now becomes then we should now be able to in this case uh integrate this one now integrating it uh it now means it will be minus two multiplied by u to the power minus a half plus one all over minus a half plus one and again plus c our constant of integration actually here it's u not x so it's u over let's not make that mistake then from there it now becomes equals to minus two u to the power half divided by a half plus c our constant of integration which is now equals to minus 2 actually minus 2 divided by half it gives me minus 4 u to the power half plus c and again you can even make it much simpler and by saying anything to the power half it means the square root it means it becomes minus 4 square root of u plus c which is now equals to minus 4 square root of remember our u we said our u uh, is equals to 2 we said our u equals to 2 minus x squared so which means here in place of u we put 2 minus x squared plus c our constant of integration uh thank you so much i hope this has been uh quite helpful uh please don't forget to like this video as well as subscribe to the channel also you can send me a message and a comment you can even tell me if you have a specific topic that you also want me to cover thank you so much and now good god bless you